to the right, to the left. Tiff, just stop. Why? Because you look like a grandma trying to get her groove back. Ruder than ham, Skipper. You're lucky you're my friend. Come on, you guys. We need to do something fun. Yeah, something crazy. Hmm. Like what? What in the? My eardrums! Barbie, this isn't fair! I want to be a part of the sleepover too! I know you do, but sometimes Skipper just needs to have some time alone with her friends. But it's my room too, and you'll survive. We can have a sleepover in my room. Okay. Hello? Hello, I'm Allie. I'm here for the sleepover. Cheese sticks, not another one. Hi, hello, I will escort you to the party. Oh, okay. She's a persistent one, isn't she? Uh-huh. Hey, did you want to join our sleepover? Um, nah, I'll just sleep on the couch or something. Okay, well, you know where to find us if you change your mind. Stacy, go away! Rude! You have another guest! What? I didn't invite anyone else. Did you guys? No. No. Stacy, no! Stacerella! Don't encourage her invasion, Tiff! Oh, sorry. She's just really fun to dance with. She's a good booty shaker. Okay, Tiff, you've gone too far. The booty don't lie. Uh, come on, Skipper. I want a party too. Get out, please. Fine, but you really do have a guest. I didn't invite anyone else, though. Nikki was sick, but... Skipper! Uh... <gasps> oh, snap! Allie? Uh, why... why are you here? To sleep over with my BFFs, of course! She is not our BFF! Uh, hold on. Friend meeting. I do not want this basic sandwich invading my party. Same. Why do you guys hate Allie so much? She can be kind of cool. All right, one, she talks forever. Two, I think she secretly dislikes me. Three, she's a snut. And four, I don't know. You guys, come see what I brought. I brought some games, pillows for pillow fighting. Oh, and finally, my cardboard cutout of Justin Bieber. How did she fit all of that into her bag? Oh, I almost forgot. I also brought nachos. N -n 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 nachos? Don't give in, Skipper. Breathe them in. Those crispity, crisp, crunchy tortilla chips perfectly covered in luscious, golden, 100% mouth-watering, velvety, warm, snuggly nacho cheese. Uh. Huh? But if you don't want me to stay, I can leave with my nachos. No, stay! Aw, best friend! I didn't know you missed me that much. Ugh. She just can't say no to food. Ugh. 
This level is so hard to beat, dude. I know. I've been trying to beat it since the other day and I still can't. Oh. Hey, you know what? My girlfriend is actually pretty good at levels like this. I should see what she's up to. Huh, I thought she didn't like Allie. A sleepover, huh? Yeah, I guess. What do girls do at sleepovers anyways? I don't know, paint each other's toes and stuff? I doubt it. That's probably what they want us dudes to think. What do you mean? I'm sure they gossip, trash talk, have pillow fights. Nah, Skipper wouldn't. She's better than that. How do you know? Cuz she's different, and I trust her. Don't you have a sister? What did she do at her sleepovers? Uh, yeah, I don't know. Like I said, they'd probably paint each other's crusty toes. You think you know a girl until they have a sleepover. Give it a rest, Doug. You don't even know what girls do at sleepovers. Well, then let's find out. Uh, why? Give me your phone. What? Let's just innocently see how Skipper answers this question. No, man. She's cool. Don't bug her. You trust her, don't you? Y yeah Uh, I'm in Nacho Heaven. Dance with me, Courtney! Why? Skipper, help! Tiff! Have here, hmm? Rider Secrets you don't want to know. Secrets? I told you. Do you trust her now? This is some shady material right here. I'll give a juicy response. No. That doesn't sound like Skipper. Let me FaceTime her. Okay. <laughs> uh. Come, Come on, on Courtney! I, just, I yeah, really just don't want to dance. Dance. Make for two seconds. That I do, okay? I just, uh, Skipper, your phone is jiggling. Give it to me. Hello? Hey, Tiff, uh, Justin and I will dance with you. Yeah! Hey. Ryder, I'm kind of busy partaying right now. I'm sorry. I know, but why did you- Oh my gosh, Justin, you are a great dancer. Justin? Ugh, I gotta go. Sorry, I love you, bye. Come dance with me, Skipper! No, wait! Oh my gosh, bro, she's cheating on you! They have a dude at their sleepover! Come on, we're going over there, right now! Yeah! Hello? Hey, hi, uh... Oh no, don't tell me you're here for the sleepover. We're here for the sleepover. Who are you? Doug? Are you supposed to be like the sleepover bouncer guard person or something? Not really, but I guess. Okay, so excuse me. Ah! 
Sleepover rule number four. No boys allowed. Not to be mean. But there's already a dude in there. Um, what? Yeah. Fine, I highly doubt it, but I'll go check. So what are we gonna do, man? We need to get to the ladies, you know? It's an emerge. And see, I know. If she doesn't let us stay, we'll need to pretend to leave and hide. Sounds like a plan. You guys, let's play truth or dare. That sounds fun. Ham, no. Come on, Skipperoni. You have no right to combine my name with my favorite pizza topping. <laughs> I ship it. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, I'll go first. Tiff, truth or dare? Hmm, truth. What was the weirdest dream you've ever had? Okay, so there was like this one time I dreamt that I was a giraffe, <laughs> but I don't even know why, cause I don't even have like an unnaturally large neck, you know? So in my dream as a giraffe, I was like eating grass and trees, the norm, and this other giraffe came over and was all like, girl, you better get off my side of the grass. And I was like, nah, -uh, these are my leaves. And then I was like, wait, you're a talking giraffe too? And he was all like, bruh, you're a talking giraffe too? And I was like, who knew? Well, I'm like, out wow, of here. Really? This is so shocking. It's like a monumental moment in my life. Nice try, but there's no guy in there. Please, I just need to talk to Skipper real quick. Persistent, but no. Roberta, how could you dare say Dang that? Dang it! Like I'm that missing to me. my show. Bro, let's hide while she's distracted. Okay. Shoo shoo now. Fine. We're leaving. Bye. Bye. I don't understand. Oh my gosh. Jimmy did not just say that to Rachel. Go, go. <laughs> now what? And so I was like, what? You're not a giraffe? You're a dolphin? Okay, I'm done with this game. B but we were just getting started. How about we just watch a movie and go to bed? How about I tell a movie? A story. A good one, I promise. Ooh, Tiff stories are the best. <laughs> Doing, turning into an alien? They were supposed to be cool movie noises. <clears throat> it was a dark and scary night. All alone in a spooky forest were four lost girls. They wandered for hours until Wrestle, wrestle, wrestle went the bushes. Oh my gosh, the bushes are all wrestled in! One girl exclaimed. They stared at the bushes for a few minutes until they stopped moving. Let's keep walking, said another girl. Right as they started to walk away, rustle, 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 went the bushes again. One of the girls decided to bravely check to see if anything was there. She slowly pulled back the branches, and there was nothing. <laughs> There's nothing there, she said. Let's keep moving. Right as she was about to turn around, she felt someone's hot breath on her shoulder. Sandy, you really need to get a mint. But it was not Sandy at all. She realized this, slowly turned around to see two tall dark shadow men. <gasps> They crept towards her, only wanting two valuable things on her face. They were the eyebrow monster stealers of the night.
they stole all the perfect eyebrows in the land. Unfortunately, the other girl's eyebrows were already gone. Run, Linda, before they take your brows too, they screamed. The girl tried to outrun them, but she tripped on a little pebble. Before she could even say oof, her eyebrows went poof, and the eyebrow monster Steelers of the Night disappeared. The girl's eyebrows never grew back, and no one has ever gone near that forest since. But rumor has it the eyebrow monsters, stealers of the night, sneak into girls' sleepovers and take their eyebrows while they're sleeping. The end. That was actually pretty dark. Tiff, where do you come up with that? My little brain likes to wander sometimes. Ah. <sighs> well, I'm exhausted. Good night. Is anyone else, like, terrified now? Courtney, don't be a wimp. Justin can guard the door. There, we're safe now. Oh, good night. Good night! Once she's asleep, we can sneak up to Skipper's room. Well, that was quick. Let's go! Ryder? What are you doing? Here! Protecting you from that guy by the door! Are you okay? Your face doesn't look okay! Chill! Justin? He's a cardboard cutout! Wait... He's... He's not a real guy? Like I would have an actual dude in here. Do you even know me? Well, the way you were texting me was highly suspicious. I said I was busy. Yeah, right. Secrets. And he looked pretty real when I was FaceTiming you. But still, I don't keep secrets from you. Whoa, slow down. I never texted that. Really? What? Someone hijacked my phone! Ryder, I would never say that to you. Come on. You can't have my eyebrows! You can't have my eyebrows! Tiff, get off of me! <laughs> okay, hold up, people. Uh, they aren't the eyebrow monster stealers of the night. Oh. The real problem is, who texted Ryder with my phone? Not me. Not me. <laughs> How about those nachos? Allie! Okay, fine. But I just sent one little text. It wasn't even that important. Heck yeah, it is, you sandwich! Uh, best friend! I just wanted to have some fun! By scaring the potato out of my boyfriend? Uh, I guess I was a little curious, too. What are you saying? See, it wasn't just my fault. Doug hyped it up, so don't get angry. Bro, you're just gonna throw me under the bus like that? You don't deserve to speak. You ruined Justin. This girl is kind of nuts. Has anyone else noticed that? Ow! Well, Doug got me thinking, like, what do girls do at sleepovers? Are you serious? Yeah? Well, that varies per girl and sleepover, I suppose. 
Some like to watch movies and eat food, and others try to be fancy and paint each other's crusty toes and stuff. I knew it! But wait, it's time for the real question. Ooh. Yes! I brought them for a reason! Huh? What do girls do to boys who break into their sleepover? They kick them out? Before they do that. Uh, what are you saying? I'm just saying... Talk to the feathers! Pillow fight! No, no, please, wait! Ah! Skipper? Come on. Ah! I think I know the answer now. Same. What is this? You're breaking rule number four! Get her! Huh? Uh. Ah! Ah! Get off of me, you sandwiches! Craziest sleepover ever. You're breaking all the rules and laws!